A big round of applause for Patron number one, David Jack. Patron number two, Josie Bluer. Big round of applause for Josie Bluer. Painter number, and I'm going to trail him around now because maybe maybe your eyesight is as bad as mine. Hey, this is Josie. Painter number three, Connie Roberstad. Big round of applause. Painter number four, Rodney Bank Victor. Excuse me. I know Rodney Baker apparently. I totally don't. Rodney Victor right here is painter number four. Painter number five is Shannon Thiessen. A crowd favorite. That, that's observational. And number six, Lori Weeb. Lori, big round of applause. So, I'm gonna give you updates when we're at 15 minutes, 10 minutes, two minutes, and one minute, but you're all right now going to help me kick off our battle number 208 here in Chilliwack. Does everybody feel up to it? Yeah. That sounded like a no, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it as a yes, and we're gonna start from 10 and count down. So 10, nine, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's paint! So again, once they're done, we'll have five minutes to vote. But keep walking around, follow me, follow the yellow brick road as it were. It's actually a yellow taped road. And we can appreciate how everybody starts off. See you in about five minutes, guys.
slow-moving, hurricanic-like tornado. It's a small room. It's great to see so many people out, and it shows us that definitely we're going to have to get a bigger room next time. So thanks for supporting and building something here. But walk, but walk. Congratulate yourself with walking. I don't exercise much, so I can use it. We have just passed the first five minutes, so 15 more minutes for these pages this first round. Remember, all paintings are available through silent auction here at the back table where I wave my clipboard. You can bid on these auction items after the battle has completed of this first round. I'll talk to you in four, four minutes or so. Come on, guys. Keep moving.
been on the inner circle of the tornado for a little while. You want to snoop out to the back and let the passing lane get a chance inside? That's just a suggestion. I don't want to tell nothing when I'm on the road.